still have to work on the child. And worry about how today is. And these many some stores, we are signed a few more stores. We have custom temple stores in Bangalore, another 30 will happen. Chennai, the first store started. Imagine a Madras eating a Vada boy in Esther Small in Chennai. How is that? And that's really a temple's journey. Sometimes I'm afraid of that. You know? That's how the story has come to us. Still a long way to go. I hope what I shared with you all, it helps you. The whole thought process was you are to be entrepreneurship, family managed business. You have to make a big call amongst your chachas. Huh? What do you call uh, Babuji's? Huh? So, if you have a child, you can see that the whole generation, which has seen in old India, they are correct from their perspective. You have a dream. But amongst like doing a balance to the old generation, maybe you have to carry your dream still further and create a niche for yourself and place your entrepreneurship in a changing view. That's the purpose. I hope you are all happy, joyful. Huh? I did a lot of mono, you know, I had this time period. Take it out, yes, sir. How much have it cost? Logistics. In business, there is a two balance. The kind of business is definitely different. You have to find a balance between inventory and logistic cost. If you have a day month, then you will have a logistic cost. If you supply once a month, your inventory cost goes up. So we have found a midway. A midway month, which is Bangalore based, Nasu based, Nasu based. And then the local transport happens every week to every store. So this balance of one month and delivery twice a week at the store level is a good balance for us as of now between inventory and logistics. So either the inventory cost goes up or the logistic cost goes up. So you have to find a balance which is better for you. What is the arithmetic for the inventory and the logistics? So we find this beautiful balance of one month logistics for Mumbai to Bangalore, Mumbai to Nagpur, Mumbai to Nasi, Mumbai to Aurangabad. And then at the local store level, from the up every week price. But then that doesn't fix your economy. What is it? That doesn't fix your economy value. Well, I mean, like transportation goes up many, many times. Okay. There are two things that happen. One beautiful word is, if you have pizza, Italy may be choking. Italy may be choking. That's smoking juice, pizza hut, and what is Domino's? Now, how many stores in Italy? Or how many stores they have outside Italy? Italy may focus here, the pricing would be very, very good. When they moved out of Italy, it became more aspirational. What about today in Bangalore is sold at 17 rupees, not sold at 17 rupees. Chennai, we are selling in Asia, more at 20 rupees. So, right now, the solution is that. Same price we are finding based on transportation cost of pricing, which is something between 15 to 20. Okay, that's a beautiful story that uh, you are at the point. Mac is here. They are buns. We are pops. They are non spicy. We are spicy. They are mine. We are chutney. My focus is the middle class India who likes to eat this. Believe me, there are 3,000 square feet stores, one to one and a half by cash collection. We have 300 square feet stores, 15,000 cash collection. Believe me, so the food on the move. So, the pricing aspect will always torment the entrepreneur throughout his life, especially in consumer business. They have to always keep on finding solutions and do a dad level reaction. And in time, volume side. We buy potatoes for 5,000 stores or 500 stores. We buy basin for 500 stores. We buy oil for 500 stores. What will happen? My RMC will go down. At that time, we will try it. It's a question of whether you get the chicken first or the eggs first. Whether you get the number of stores first or you get the... You are with me? What would I do? So, short term, this is a big. Long term, what will happen? So, I have not increased my real estate cost. We have not put 3,000 stores. We have not added air condition. We are not put high tech manpower of 50 people to run a store. We still have entrepreneurs.